Hey guys, welcome to my new video. In this video, I'll try to show you how to get face unlock option on your Xiaomi device with a small trick. So let's start the video. But before I start, kindly subscribe to my channel and also hit the bell icon. So you will get notified every time I post a new video. So guys, this is a common problem in some of the Xiaomi devices. For example, this device Mi 8 Lite. Now this device comes with a face unlocking option. So it has face unlocking and fingerprint both the options. But for some reason, not only this device I bought last time Redmi 6 Pro also and Redmi Note 6 Pro also, it has the same issue that for some reason, even if you buy the global version, when you try to use face unlock, it does not show in the settings. Let, let me just show you. So this is the setting. When you go to lock screen and password, you don't see any face unlock option over here. But this is a global version, so, so definitely I was expecting this to have a face unlock option. And after searching some MIUI forum, I found out how to use face unlock in this device. It's quite irritating and annoying that Xiaomi does not include this with all its devices, which has the option inbuilt. So I live in UAE. When I click on my region, is you can see that in region, I live in UAE, so when the device asks you for the region, you definitely choose the region where you live in. For some reason, Xiaomi is not including this face unlock option in all the regions of the world for even as global version. Now, unfortunately, it's only, you know, available in few countries. So if I change my region, if I go to my settings and change my region to Hong Kong, you can see over here, if I change it to Hong Kong, Now you can see that my region has been changed to Hong Kong. Now if I change the region to Hong Kong, I don't even have to reset the device. I just go to the settings and I go to the face lock screen and password. And you can see over here that it's showing the option of add face data. So this is kind of a bit annoying also. But at the same time, this is how it is. And definitely when you change the region, you will have to manually change your date and time setting because it will not give you accurate timing otherwise. But this is how you can enable face unlock in any country you live in. You have to just change the settings, change your region to Hong Kong. So when you go to the date and time, So as you can see, I have disabled the automatic date and time because my region is Hong Kong. You can see Hong Kong, select time zone. Because I've chosen the region Hong Kong, now if I choose automatically, it will give me Hong Kong timing. This is a bit annoying and this is something which uh, Xiaomi should, you know, change in its future updates for all the devices, all the new devices which is coming with the face unlock option. So I have to manually set the time of the country where I live in. So this is a small uh, tip which I would like to give all my viewers that if you buy a new Xiaomi device and suppose you don't get the face unlock options in a lot of new devices, Redmi 6 Pro, Redmi Note 6 Pro, Pocophone F1 or Mi i8 Lite, these devices are coming with face unlock option but for some reason Xiaomi does not include in the settings. So you have to change the region to find this setting. That's a very useful feature so when you pay this much price you deserve to have this feature. So this is a small video about the tips and tricks how to get the face unlock in any country you live in. Just you have to change the region. I have made lots of videos on Xiaomi Mi 8 Lite. You can click over here to see those videos in the playlist. If you like my content and like my videos, kindly subscribe to my channel and hit the thumbs up. I will really appreciate that. See you in my next video. Till then, goodbye and peace out. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you like the video, kindly hit the thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I will really appreciate that. Also click on the notification icon, the bell icon. So you'll constantly get updated with my new videos. Thank you for watching and see you in my next video. Till then, goodbye.